I said, you still do them in the same key? He said, probably. He said, you got anything black to wear? I said, I'll find something. He said, show starts at 2 o'clock. We open with Folsom. All right. Elated, Marty called his sister Jennifer to share his good fortune. But Cash had been such a revered figure in the Stewart home that she couldn't believe her brother was actually about to join Johnny's band. When he called, I was going, oh, please, you're kidding, you know. And I said, I guess you're going to get a job with the Rolling Stones, too. So he said, no, just cash. That's enough. I walked out on stage at the Civic Center, I think, in Des Moines. When he said, hello, I'm Johnny Cash, oh, my head, I cried. That's, that's it. This is as good as it gets. Johnny Cash's effect on Marty extended well beyond music. In 1982, while Marty was taping a TV special with Johnny, he noticed a striking young woman on the set. And I looked and I thought, she's a beautiful girl. 